know you don't like me. You wanna fight me. You don't want no problems at your party. Don't invite me. Hi guys, welcome back to the channel. In this video, uh, I'm gonna be going over what happened in the draft, who I was at about being drafted, and what I think is coming. And yeah, I'm wearing a King Corbin shirt, so that's cool. And we're just gonna get started, so let's start off with Monday Night Raw. So on Monday Night Raw, the women that I predicted correctly were Asuka, Shayna, Naya, Lana, Mandy, Dana, Mia Yim, and Peyton Royce. The rest of the people, uh, like the men, I got right were Drew McIntyre, Randy Orton, Tucker, Miz, Morrison, Angel Garza, Eric of the Viking Raiders, Seamus, Lindsay Dorado, Grand Metalik, Jeff Hardy, Slapjack, T-Bone, Dia Madden, Ali, Ricochet, Braun Strowman, and Keith Lee, Matt Riddle, and finally, Elias. So the rest of the people that are on Raw that got drafted to Raw, I was wrong about like the Hurt Business and Naomi and stuff, but we'll cover that later. Well, actually we won't, because I'm not going over everybody I got wrong. So what I think is going to be happening on Raw is we only have two tag team now, and that's, well for the women, and that's Nia Jax and Shayna and Mandy and Dana. In my opinion, the right squad should have stayed on Raw, and Natalia and Lana shouldn't have broken up, but whatever. Anyways, um, so I think in the main, like, singles title area, uh, this Monday night, like, coming Monday night, Lana is gonna get wrecked by Asuka, or Nia's gonna come out in the middle of the match and put Lana through a table, or something like that. And then Charlotte's gonna make her return and be like, I want my title shot at Hell in the Cell because I'm Charlotte and that's how it goes. And I think she's gonna get her way and then she's gonna take the title and then that's gonna start this new Alexa versus Charlotte feud. Or Os or not Oscar, um, Alexa's gonna fight Nikki and then she's gonna join this new Wyatt family thing. Then I also think that The Miz is going to fight Otis for his money in the bank and then win it because there's no way they're letting Otis cash in on Roman Reigns. So they're probably going to give it to someone on Raw to cash in on Randy Orton when he beats Drew McIntyre at Hell in the Cell, which is just my prediction. Um, and the person that will probably start feuding for that title will probably be either Adava Kato or... Braun Strowman or Keith Lee, they're probably going to have like a triple threat like feud. They're all going to be after each other since they're all the bigger guys. And then I think Bobby Lashley is going to start going after, well, the whole Hurt Business. Is going to start going after like someone like Jeff Hardy or Sheamus or something. And yeah, I don't really know like the tag teams on Raw anymore, so the New Day don't really have much opponents to fight, so that's good. Okay, now we're going to head over to SmackDown and see the people that I got right over there, starting off with the women. So, so far, I got right Sasha, Bailey, Carmella, Billy Kay, and Bianca Belair. So, as you can see, I did not get a lot of the women right. Um, if Mickey James does go to SmackDown, because she's still undrafted, I will also be right about her. Um, and then the men that I got right were Big E, Lars Sullivan, um, Roman Reigns, Seth Rollins, Dominic Mysterio, Rey Mysterio, Buddy Murphy, um, King Corbin, um, Kalisto, Apollo Crews, Robert Roode, Montez Ford, Angelo Dawkins, Cesaro, and Nakamura. Those are all the people that I got right from SmackDown. That's less than what I said for Raw, but at least I got some of them right. And I was wrong about a lot of them, like Shorty G, Natalia, all of that. So, um, the new SmackDown roster looks okay. 
I think it needs a few more women, like Nikki James, but then Chelsea and Vanessa need to debut with Carmella or something. We're going to have uh, Sasha versus Bailey for a while, so I'm, I'm over their storyline anyway, so like, at least like for now, I want them to restart it around Mia time, but that's just me. After Roman kills Jey Uso, who I also got right, I don't know if I said that in my thing, but I also got Jey Uso. Anyways, after Roman kills him, Otis loses his briefcase, I think it's going to start a feud between him and Seth Rollins. Or him and King Corbin again, who knows. King Corbin. And then Sami Zayn is probably going to feud with uh, Lars Sullivan, who I knew was going to come back. I just thought he was going to be part of the Wyatt family, but I was wrong. And then there's more tag teams that I know over here. But I think Cesaro and Nakamura are going to be the first ones that feud with Montez and... Angelo, so yeah. Alright guys, thanks for watching this video. Like, comment, subscribe, do all that, and yeah. I hope you guys like the draft I did. Um, these are just my predictions and opinions, and yeah. Thanks for watching again. Bye.